The story of creation is told in Genesis 1, 1 through 2, 4. From the very beginning, where the universe was formless, to the creation of light, the heavens and the earth, the birth of all life, and finally, to the creation of humankind in the image of God. In the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth, and the earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the deep, and the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the waters, and God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw the light, that it was good, and God divided the light from the darkness, and God called the light day, and the darkness he called night, and the evening and the morning were the first day. God's work continued over six days. On the second day, he created the sky. The third day saw the formation of land and seas, along with vegetation. The fourth day brought the creation of the sun, moon, and stars to mark time and seasons. On the fifth day, God filled the waters with fish and the skies with birds, blessing them to multiply. The sixth day saw the creation of land animals and finally humans, made in God's own image, to whom he gave dominion over all creation and provided every plant and tree for food. God saw everything he had made and it was very good. Thus, the heavens and the earth were finished. On the seventh day, God ended his work which he had made and he rested from all his work. And God blessed the seventh day, sanctified it, and rested. These are the generations of the heavens and of the earth when they were created, in the day that the Lord God made the earth and the heavens, and every plant of the field before it was in the earth, and every herb of the field before it grew. For the Lord God had not caused it to rain upon the earth, and there was not a man to till the ground. But there went up a mist from the earth, and watered the whole face of the ground. And the Lord God formed man of the dust of the ground, and breathed into his nostrils the breath of life, and man became a living soul. In these verses, we witness the power and glory of God's creation, from the calling forth of light out of darkness to the formation of the earth and its creatures. Each step is deliberate, each creation good in the eyes of the Lord. The culmination of this divine work is the creation of humankind, bearing the image of God, entrusted with the stewardship of all creation. This story isn't just about the origins of the earth. It's a reflection of God's power, creativity, and love. It teaches us about our responsibility to care for the world and reminds us of our special place within creation crafted in the image of the Creator. Let's remember our role in this world. We are caretakers of the earth. In our daily lives, let us embrace this calling with joy and gratitude, honoring the Creator by caring for His creation. We hope to see you tomorrow. Remember you are loved.